Hey everyone, thank you guys so much for joining me for today's Game of Thrones cocktail video. Now, a few weeks ago when I posted Sansa Stark's cocktail, I will link that in the description below if you're interested in that cocktail, I asked you guys whether or not you wanted to see the Hound or the Mountain made into a cocktail. And the Hound has won, so I am going to show you how to make the Hound today. The Hound has been such an interesting character throughout the show. He was a villain, then a victim, then a hero, and all kind of that lies in between. And this last episode that just aired this past Sunday, he had some beautiful scenes with both Arya and Sansa and has a very interesting relationship with both of them. I'm so glad that the Hound and Arya are back on the road again together and I think their relationship has evolved so much to where they now see each other as equals and I feel like that journey with them going back to King's Landing is such an interesting story to tell so I'm really looking forward to it. But let's get into this cocktail. We are going to start with a base of bourbon because it's a nice stiff drink for the Hound. And then we're gonna use grapefruit juice, simple syrup, orange bitters, and then we're going to be using Dogfish Heads Namaste. Now, I felt like it was right to put a beer in the Hound's cocktail because he's always drinking ale. And Dogfish Head not only has great beers, but he's also the Hound, so that's why I'm using this brand. And I also chose to use the Namaste Belgian White because he's also had a lot of religious awakening. You know, after his near-death experience when Brienne almost killed him, he was left for dead. He helped build a church. He joined the Brotherhood and so many things have changed for his character. Now all that is left is for us to see him go and face his brother. All right, so the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put ice in my shaker and then I'm gonna add two ounces of bourbon. I'm gonna use bullet because it's what I have on hand. Then we're gonna add a half of an ounce of simple syrup. You wanna make it just a little sweet and I would only recommend putting the simple syrup in it if you are using fresh squeezed grape juice, which I am today, is the only reason I would put simple syrup in it. If you are gonna use just regular grape juice from a grape juice bottle, I would say skip the simple syrup altogether because it will be too sweet. Because I'm using a fresh grapefruit, I am gonna put just a half an ounce of simple syrup. And then I'm going to squeeze my grapefruit juice and I want about three ounces. All right, so this is the first two, and then I want one more. All right, I'm gonna pour that third ounce in, and then I'm gonna add about five drops of orange bitters. This just gives it a teeny bit of a citrus and bitter flavor. All right, and then I'm gonna pop my shaker top on and give it a shake. All right, and then I'm gonna take a fresh, clean glass and put some ice in it. And then I'm going to pour my cocktail directly over the ice. And then I'm gonna pop open my Namaste by Dogfish Head. Then you're gonna add about two ounces of the Namaste Belgian White. Be very careful when pouring this into your measuring tool because it's gonna bubble up really quick and then you're gonna get foam and not a lot of beer. And then you're gonna take that and you're gonna pour it directly into your cocktail and you're gonna give it a bit of a stir. And here you have the Hound. I've decided not to garnish it because I feel like the Hound wouldn't wanna garnish on his drink. Enjoy this one. If you guys do not follow me on Instagram, I will put a link in the description below. I usually do polls and tell you guys what's upcoming on the channel. So if you don't follow me, follow me there. So here is to the Hound. May he win against the mountain. So what I want you guys to do is vote on fan favorites because I will be doing one more Game of Thrones cocktail video. Tormon will be in the fan favorites, but I'm looking for two to three more characters to do for the finale of Game of Thrones. Let me know which characters are your favorite, dead or alive, popular, unpopular. Let me know, and the final video will be coming out before the Game of Thrones finale. I hope you guys enjoy this one, and I will see you in the next one.